Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. Good evening and welcome to Alcor, welcome to the Al Bayt Stadium, the venue for this one. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner as usual is Stuart Robson. And really looking forward to bringing you this World Cup round of 16 match. It's France against England. Absolutely, this should be a good game. I think both sides deserve to be here, but whichever team plays to their full potential should make it into the quarterfinals. It's going to be a good game. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris between the posts. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. And up front, Karim Benzema plays alongside Kylian Mbappe. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. John Stones plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Calvin Phillips plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the main striker today is Harry Kane. Individual brilliance. Kane! A goal in the early stages. Precisely what they had been planning. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And then it's a top-class strike from Kane. His technique is absolutely spot-on. Just look at the power he generates here. Goal. And France get the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? Benzema Mbappe wanted to keep it but couldn't Harry Kane Mount Phil Foden now he read the situation defensively and did his job corner given now sending it in now too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat England looking dangerous. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. He landed really awkwardly on his shoulder there and is in some discomfort. But he's a tough cookie. Oh, they could be in! Oh, wonderful save! Well, he reacts so quickly there. That's a great save. Played in by Griezmann, and the danger's still on. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Karim Benzema, he's very adept at protecting the ball. A very timely interception. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Will he play it in? Kane. Now with Sterling. 
Surely rifled against the post, but back in play. Well, had that gone in, the game was firmly in their hands. Now, though, they've got to make sure they don't let this slip. Now can they make something happen? Griezmann! Nice and easy for the keeper. Sterling. And Mount. Kane. Well-timed tackle. Rabiot. Here's Mbappe. Harry Kane. Sterling has it. And back with Matt. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Yusuf Fofana. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. The first half here comes to an end. And the ball is moving again, with England looking to build on a largely positive first-half performance. Uba Makana. Now Rabiot. Mbappe. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Tremendous ball played through. Well, it was easy on the eye, but the interception was made. Aurelien Chouameni. Benzema. Mbappé. Mbappé! Well driven fiercely against the frame of the goal. Well, he struck it well enough, but that has to go down as a big miss. Entering the match, number 22, Jude Bellingham. Well, as you can see, England haven't had that much of the ball, but their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. And Sterling has it. Must be! Oh, he's found the net! And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Well, as you can see again, Kane plays a perfectly weighted pass beyond the defenders and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Goal! 2-0 now and back underway. Well, we're into the final half hour. Chouameni. And France pushing forward with options available. Now this could really lift spirits. He's given it straight to the opposition. Harry Kane. Well, he's given it away. Jude Bellingham. Twenty minutes to go. 
Karim Benzema. A real opening now. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. And Bellingham. It is a decent looking attack here. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. And time for the change now. Yusuf Fofana entering the match. Number 22, Theo Hernandez. Radio. Now Griezmann using his physical strength to shield it. <laughs> Bellingham. Here's Mount. Jude Bellingham. Might really be able to trouble them here. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Griezmann. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Leading the match. Number two, Benjamin Papar. Coming out of the pitch. Number 20, Kingsley Kona. Substitution for the hosts. Coming off the pitch. Number 19, Mason Mount. To be replaced by... Number eight, Jordan Shaw. Anderson. And Bellingham. Well, if you're wondering about out of time, two minutes it'll be. And well, that pass needed to be a lot more precise. Sterling. And return to Henderson. Chance to finish. And up for grabs off the keeper. Danger averted for now. And now the end of the contest. England have made it through to the last eight. Yeah, I thought it was a fairly comfortable win in the end. They played really attractive football at times. And there were some good individual performances. They'll certainly be happy going into the next round. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority and attack, Stuart. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.